Hey, what's up, y'all? Welcome back to my channel. I hope everyone's having a marvelous day today. Hey, look, y'all, I wasn't going to make... I, I, I didn't care anything, honestly, and I still don't really care anything about uh, Beyonce going country. I don't care one way or the other. You know what I'm saying? Um, I, I don't know why it's being made such a big deal about. I don't know if it's made being made such a big deal because it's Beyonce or is it being made such a big deal because it's a black woman that's going country? But I'm I'm also thinking, you know, I'm going with, with what I said at first, it's being made a big deal because it's Beyonce, because we already had a black woman uh, that switched over from R&B to the country music genre, you know, back a little while ago, which was Kay Michelle. And I haven't heard anything... Uh, other than when Kay Michelle announced that she was going country, that was the only, the first and the last time that I heard anything about Kay Michelle and, you know, and, and the country music thing. But now since Beyonce has come out and, you know, she's going over to the country genre, now all of a sudden Kay Michelle's name is being brought up. So that's that's just always like kind of, you know, that's just always like kind of weird to me because why is it always like, you know, you try to pit black women, you try to, I'm not even going to say black women because right now, right now, when you look on social media, it's more black on black beef. You know, we have. R&B singers beefing with each other. You know, of course, the rappers, they're going to stay beefing. Uh, you know, it's just all crazy. Black actors and actresses that's beefing with each other, comedians and this. You know, every time I get on social media here lately, especially within these past few weeks, it's always, you know, drama with somebody you know we had the cat williams against everybody thing we had that now we got monique against whoever she's against and and the son against her and k michelle and beyonce and mike epps and shannon sharp and you know what i'm saying y'all like like the list just goes on so you know that's just kind of crazy but back to this beyonce going country thing like i said in the beginning i really don't care one way or another I mean, I, I like Beyonce, and I would even consider myself a fan of Beyonce, but I'm not, y'all, I'm not, uh, y'all, I'm not, like, a hardcore fan of Beyonce that I'm following her every move and following at her feet and want to know what she's doing 24-7 and all that type of stuff. I mean, I like her music and, and all. So, you know, like I said, I am a fan of her. But I'm not a I'm not a super fan. I'm not a hardcore fan. I'm not a stan. I'm not you know what I'm saying. I'm not a beehive. I'm I'm not any I'm not any of that. So like I said, Beyonce going country did didn't make me any type of difference one way or another. But I I saw um okay and and I came across something just like I said it it's because you don't you don't hear anything like I'm, I'm thinking about with the country genre. I don't, I haven't heard, I mean, I'm sure that it, it has happened throughout the years or sometime over the years or whatever that you had two uh, country music artists that were beefing with each other or in some type of competition or whatever the case may be. Because in, in, in that field and in, in the industry, it's, it, it's almost always pretty much about competition. So everybody's, uh, you know, like I said, almost or always in competition with somebody else. So, like I said, I'm sure that there has been competition uh, with female country singers, but you don't you don't hear it like this. Like I don't know. I mean, like y'all, I'm I'm seriously I'm seriously thinking about it. Like I don't hear about you know I don't hear anything about them pitting. Taylor Swift and I don't even know if Taylor Swift does country or or she just straight pop. So I'm not sure, but let's just say Taylor Swift and Kelly Clarkson or whoever. Let's just say, you know what I'm saying? You don't hear you have these these two women making 
this genre of music and it's being played everywhere and it's being celebrated everywhere and there's no type of beeping or anything or anything about it anywhere and everywhere. But now you have Beyonce coming out uh, saying that she's going country and you have K. Michelle, like I said, that went country a, a little while back. She went country. So now you have two black women that's moved over to the country, John, your music side. And now you got all of this going on. Now you got all of this beef. Like I said, y'all wasn't talking about K. Michelle. Y'all was not talking about K. Michelle at all in, in, her, in, in her country music. But now, since Beyonce is doing country, you know, then, you know, now K. Michelle's name is being brought up. But what I saw, y'all, like I said, this this has been because she announced it during the Super Bowl. So this, you know, this has been floating around, going around for the past few days now. So I did see that uh, radio stations, country music radio stations, aren't playing uh, Beyonce's country song. And I kind of get it. I I, I kind of get it. Um, I mean, I, I kind of get it. And then I also think that race has a lot to do with that, just like it does with everything else in America. Race has something to do with every single thing because, uh, you know, Robin Thicke and uh, Justin Timberlake and some of those other, uh, you know, those type artists, they didn't have any problem at all coming over from their genre, which was, you know, mostly pop music, but they didn't have any issues at all coming from their genre and coming over to, uh, to the R&B side and R&B radio stations played their music. But can we really expect for a country music? Y'all, I'm just, because we as, you know, because it, it's just like we as black people, just like I saw someone on social media commenting on something that I, I uh, something that I was I was reading earlier, and somebody commented that black people are the fastest to invite people to the cookout, and that is that is so very true. You might have a video that pop up, and you have this Caucasian person that's doing one thing or singing a song or doing it a dance or something that's, you know, that's popular in, in you know, among, in the black communities. And we see a video of this person just doing this real quick. And then all of a sudden they're invited to the cookout or because somebody said this, they're invited to the cookout, but we don't know anything else about this person, but we inviting them to the cookout. And, and y'all can see, cause them people prove time and time again, they ain't inviting us nowhere. Not, not that fact. They, they not inviting us nowhere. But we, you know, somebody do a little spin or somebody say a little, you know, say a little something and then, you know, yeah, we, we invite, he invited to the cookout. And y'all see that, that on the other side, these people not even, are not even going to play, you know, it, it's such a, it's, it's a dispute with them playing her music, which I don't see an issue because if you're a country music station, if it's country music, regardless of the race of the artist, it should be played. If it's country music, if it's if it's that genre of music, why can it not be played on this radio station? So that right there, that is, you know, that that seems to me like more of a race thing than anything else. But then I also looked at it another kind of way because I don't know y'all. Maybe them people don't want maybe them people don't want no dealings with Beyonce. Maybe they don't want Beyonce coming into their genre and them having to worry about her silly fans and 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 everything else that follows Beyonce. You know what I'm saying? Because I I, I can I, I get that part too. And just like I said, y'all, you know, it's just kind of crazy. But I don't know. I, I honestly I didn't even really even listen to the song like i said y'all i don't care so you know i ain't I, I i hear it at one point or another maybe you know some point soon but i'm just not really pressed to hear it right now but like i said her going country made me no bit of difference one way or 
or one way or the other. And I wish that people would stop making such a big deal about, you know, such a big deal about little things. So, like I was saying, y'all, it really didn't make me one difference. It still doesn't make me one difference one way or the other. The reason why I wanted to make this video is because, like I said, I wanted to add my two cents and to say, I, why, you know, she Beyonce is going country. So what? So what? If that lady wants to, the artists, artists switch around in genres all the time. Look, look at, look at, look at hip hop. Look at rap. Right now, you have pop artists that's rapping in their songs, and, it, and it's been that way for years. Just like I said, we so quick to invite people to the cookout until, you know, I'm, I'm not, I, I was just about to say something, but that's another story for another day. So let's get back to Beyonce. But yeah, I just don't see what the big deal is. And, and it's like people just love making issues out of something that shouldn't even be an issue. Just like I said, with the radio stations that, you know, the country genre stations that don't want to play Beyonce's music, that is looking a little suspect because, you know, if she's doing country genre and that's the, that's the type of music that your radio station plays, I don't see why you won't play her, you know, not play all of her music, but just play her new, new music that she, her new country music. Just play that, but I don't even know if they're playing K Michelle's right now. But like I said, it wasn't a big deal made about K Michelle, so I really don't know what's going on as far as um, you know what what she's doing. If she if, if her album is out yet, and you know if her songs are being played on the country radio stations, y'all, because it's it's a lot that I don't know because a lot of this stuff I really don't care to to know anything about I'll care to know about it when I care to know about it but just like right now just like I said at the beginning of this video I didn't care anything about Beyonce going country not a care at all in the world but because the way everybody else carrying on about it and it's just all over the place and the radio stations won't play it and now all of a sudden k michelle's name being pulled up like y'all ain't paid k michelle there ain't nobody said nothing about k michelle not like how y'all dragging her into this now and then she didn't even had to make a statement k michelle even had to come out and say that she what you know that she's a fan of beyonce like why y'all why y'all put you know pitting us together i'm a fan of beyonce like, K. Michelle didn't say anything about Beyonce making country music, and Beyonce didn't say anything about K. Michelle making country music. That's just something that, y'all, that, just like I said, because it's two black women, and it's just something that, you know, y'all, I don't know, y'all. I, I just don't, just like I said, I don't have a care in the world. I don't care what Beyonce is doing. And all, like I said, I'm a fan because I, I I like her music and all of that. But I'm not a super fan. I'm not. I don't care what Beyonce doing 24-7. I don't care to hear Beyonce news 24-7. And I don't care to hear Beyonce's music 24-7. Well, sometimes I might feel like hearing her, you know. But, you know, like I said, y'all, I'm a fan of her. But I'm just not a super fan. So I ain't going all out like that. So y'all, like I said, I don't, I don't, you know, Beyonce going country, you know, kudos to her. And uh, I, I hope that everything works out as far as, because I, I think at some point the radio stations, that the fans keep requesting the radio stations will play her music. But even if they don't, it's not like y'all can't play them on y'all own. I can't, I can't see, y'all, I'm serious. I can't see <laughs> an old racist you know, Caucasian person, and this is their favorite radio station. They play all their favorite country music, you know, all throughout the years and all that type of stuff. And then you have Beyonce pop up on the radio station, y'all. So I think I think that right there, if they, regardless if they play this woman's music or not, I, I think that it will, it, it, it's going to cause some ruckus. It's going to cause some ruckus because you have some people that don't want her on their stations, period. 
You just have some people that do not want her on their stations. Like I said, you can't be mad at them about that. And then you have some people that's going to want to force the, the radio to play her. So, you know, like I said, whichever way this plays out, it's whatever way it plays out. But, you know, uh, I guess, like I said, y'all, we will see. But that's that on that, y'all. Because, like I said, I really didn't care too much uh, about this one way or the other. I just wanted to put my two cents in and, and, you know, Beyonce decides to do. But I just wish that people would stop making such a big deal and making all of these issues over something that doesn't it it, it doesn't it, it shouldn't be an issue at all like it should not be an issue at all like it, it we have so much stuff going on in this world that are real issues that's just you know just out there and it seems like no one is trying to do anything about it just all of this chaos and and all of this just everything going on in this world right now that really are issues that like seriously really are life and death issues and y'all make a a, a issue a, a such a big deal out of beyonce going country child y'all don't save that energy just like i said for all all the real stuff that's going on out here if y'all don't save y'all energy for that and let this woman go ahead and do what she gonna do and but y'all, can we please just stop? Because it's it's not even it's not even anything that should have been made an issue of in the first place. And then just like I said, not only is Beyonce going country and a radio station's not playing her uh her music, you know, such an issue right now, but y'all then dragged K Michelle into it when when nobody said anything about K Michelle going country like i said we heard it and then we didn't hear about it again at least i didn't anyway so y'all you know let's just see where that go well you know like i said again i really don't care where it go y'all because i don't know how many times i said this maybe about four or five times throughout this video but i'm gonna say it one more time again right here i really don't care one way or the other it makes me no bit of difference at all if it sounds good i'll listen to it if not i won't just as simple as that but look i'm out y'all thank y'all for uh watching my video and coming to my channel hey y'all upon completion of my video i saw that beyonce's music is finally getting played on country radio so i just wanted to update my video uh to add that in because i, I did mention all through my video how uh country radio stations weren't playing her uh country songs so, like I said, y'all, I did that video a couple of days ago and, and literally just completed it a little while ago. And uh, then, like I said, after completion, I saw that her music is getting played on country radio stations. So that's a win for Beyonce and a win for other black artists who may want to go into the country genre. So, like I said, y'all, I just wanted to update my video to add that her stuff is getting played on country radio. And like I said, that's a win for her and a win for black artists who, who are looking into going country. So, with that being said, y'all, I'm out.